Hello and welcome to PageRage Video Tutorials. My name is Jen and today I will be guiding you through how to install PageRage for Google Chrome. So first step is to go to PageRage.com and our full website URL is www.pagerage.com. Once you get to our home page, first step is to download our free browser plugin. And you can do so by clicking on this green button to download. And just give Google Chrome a couple seconds so you can see it's downloading down here. And once you click on that icon, it'll ask you if you want the program to make the following changes to your computer. Click Yes. And this is the PageRage installer screen. Uh, just gives you some background information about PageRage and also more information about PageRage being an ad-supported product. You also have access to our terms of service from the screen as well as privacy policy if you have any other questions. So once you read over that screen, click Next and this screen is for installation options. You have the option to use PageRage as your default search and you can opt out. Also you have the option to add the PageRage toolbar. Um, you can opt out of this as well. Um, since Google Chrome doesn't use toolbars you can just go ahead and uncheck that option. And the, uh, the last option is Yon2 Layers and you must have this checked in order to install PageRage. So once you have finished with that screen, click Install and just give it a couple seconds and there we go, it's completed. Click Finish. So now that we have Yon2 Layers installed for PageRage, next step is to select an actual layout to apply to your Facebook profile. So you can go back to the home page and you have a couple options on how to search for our layouts. You can use um, our, our pages right here to search for layouts within our library. You can also use our categories on the left hand side to search particular layouts as well as using our search box at the top to search for layouts. Um, if pre-made layouts aren't your thing, you can also create your own layouts by clicking here to sign up for a user account. Once you sign up for a user account, you'll be able to create your own layouts using our uh, CYOL tool. So we're not going to create a layout today in this demonstration. We're just going to select a pre-made layout. So I'll go to our featured layouts category where we offer um, our newest layouts. And we have spring layouts right now and some Easter layouts. So I'll go ahead and preview this Spring Owls layout. And the Spring Owls layout, I just wanted to show on my profile only. So select Profile Only, and then select this layout. So my layout has been applied. So all I need to do now is log into my Facebook account to see my layout applied. So now I remember that I only applied the layout to my profile page, so just click on Profile and click the Refresh key if you don't see your layout popping up. And there we go. Now you can have a PageRage layout on your Facebook profile. And just keep in mind that with Google Chrome in particular, like you saw in this demonstration, when you first add a layout and you navigate to your profile or just your all pages on your Facebook profile in general, remember to hit the refresh key. That usually helps refresh your browsing history and it pops up that layout right away. And also keep in mind that on PageRage.com for extra help if you need assistance with PageRage, check out our support page um, where we answer general questions that many of our users ask on a day-to-day -day basis. We're here to help you. You can also contact remote support if you need one-on-one -on -one assistance with PageRage. Also, remember to check out our PageRage blog to stay updated on the most um, updated stories of you know what we have, have updated with PageRage as well as Remember to like us on Facebook, follow us on Twitter, um, check out our YouTube channel for more video tutorials, as well as follow us on MySpace.